There is one frequently asked flat earth question that is more rhetorical than inquisitive, more a defense mechanism than a genuine query, and tends to be the final discussion point allowed by stubborn globe defenders before completely refusing to further engage with the subject. Regardless of the answer you provide, no matter how articulately and convincingly you argue, after asking this question, they will almost always throw their hands up and claim the entire pursuit of truth to be futile. This final Flat Earth FAQ, formulated one of several ways, is, so what if the Earth is flat? Why is Flat Earth important? Why does the shape of the Earth even matter? What difference does it make to my life? And my personal favorite, I still have to get up and go to work in the morning, so why should I care? When a globe defender reaches this point, it is basically a Hail Mary, white flag, full retreat, surrender, admitting that anything short of winning the lottery is unimportant to them, because that is literally the only thing that could fulfill such a ridiculous prerequisite. If the Flat Earth revelation doesn't somehow make them an overnight millionaire, they don't want to hear about it. Imagine if your friends or family said this about any other subject you tried discussing with them. For example, Suppose your spouse cheated on you, and when you tried to talk about it with your best friend, they responded by saying, regardless of whether or not you were lied to, I still have to get up and go to work in the morning, so it doesn't matter to me. It is absolutely rude and completely ridiculous to require someone to relieve you of your need for employment to be deserving of discussion. So then, why does it matter what shape the earth is? Why should anyone care whether Earth is a level, motionless plane, or a tilting, wobbling, spinning space ball? Firstly, the thing of crucial importance is the lie, not the shape. The lie of heliocentrism is one of the most insidious lies imaginable, uprooting people's common sense and lived experience, and replacing them with unproven theories and explanations from supposed experts. When children are indoctrinated from an early age to abandon the evidence of their senses in favor of this nonsensical globe model, a schism occurs in their psyche where they are no longer able to trust their own senses and experience, and instead must trust information completely contrary to it presented by perceived authority figures. This is incredibly deceitful and disempowering to the individual to teach such a singular false cosmology, and the result is humanity has become just like the slaves in Plato's allegory of the cave. Once a child is convinced that they cannot trust the evidence of their senses, they become forever thereafter chained inside Plato's cave. Unable to see the outside world as it actually is, the child is condemned to a life of watching shadows cast on the wall by Plato's puppet masters. Teaching this false, nihilistic, materialistic cosmology as absolute truth is psychologically traumatizing and spiritually devastating, causing believers to lose faith in anything beyond the material world. The result is a cultish following of scientism, the veritable New World religion, complete with a creation and destruction story, prophets and prophecies, yet without any purpose or higher power. So-called scientists have become the new priestly class, with educations and explanations supposedly so advanced that us neophytes have no choice but to blindly believe them. This then becomes fertile ground for further deceptions, as people uprooted from their true foundations and given false bearings can be led anywhere. So why does the shape of the earth matter? Again, it's not about the shape. It's about the lie. The fact that humanity has been completely deceived for the better part of five centuries regarding something so fundamental and foundational as where we live and where we came from makes the heliocentric globe model the greatest and most successful hoax in human history. To fool nearly the entirety of humanity for multiple generations, stripping people of their common sense and replacing it with carefully crafted lies is obviously a matter of serious importance. It is one of the most psychologically devastating things that could be perpetrated upon an individual, and seeing through it should be one of the most revealing revelations of a lifetime. 
So when someone asks the asinine question of what difference does it make, that is already evidence of extreme psychological distortion. If knowing the truth doesn't matter to your life, what does that say about your life? Flat Earth is an epic epiphany that changes many people to their core by adding a spiritual dimension to their lives, affirming their common sense, developing their critical thinking skills, curing their existential apathy, and reigniting a spirit of discovery and adventure. In this way, the Flat Earth revelation is holistically helpful and truly transformational for many on an individual level. Even more importantly, however, is if humanity succeeds in fully exposing this egregious lie and finally routing out the liars, the beneficial ripple effect it will have throughout society is massive. When the spinning spaceball Earth is finally exposed worldwide for the 500-year deception it was, humanity will suddenly be faced with the reality that every government, every space agency, university, religious organization, mainstream and alternative media outlet have all been duplicitous in propping up a monstrous manipulation to fleece and control the masses. Once these fundamental truths are exposed, these lying politicians, spokesmen, reporters, and teachers suddenly transform from being heralded voices of authority to being ridiculed, shunned, and denounced as they deserve. Once these foundational facts are realized, these governments, universities, media outlets, and other entangled organizations, which have long been hard at work weaving this multi-generational heliocentric myth, suddenly and completely lose all credibility. The resulting mass mental exodus away from the control system is exactly what is needed. Furthermore, once our true cosmology is revealed, so too is the truth of these few elite families and secret societies who have kept this most important reality hidden from us for these hundreds of years. Essentially, once the Flat Earth conspiracy is exposed, so is every other important conspiracy by proxy, because this so-called mother of all conspiracies holds under its umbrella so many fundamental and foundational facts and fully reveals them. In this way, Flat Earth is like the Achilles heel of the New World Order. This subject, supposedly the most crackpot of all conspiracy theories, mocked and ridiculed for centuries as being an ignorant, unscientific worldview, is actually one of the most easily demonstrable and empirically evidence facts of reality. When humanity finally wakes up to the truth of our flat earth, it will usher in a veritable new age of enlightenment, a renaissance of common sense, and an opportunity to finally and forever expose and expunge these deceivers among us.